Hey guys, it's me, Thriftastic Mom, and today I'm going to show you a Aldi's haul, which is everything that I got on my table here. And I did pick up a few things from Walmart yesterday, so I'll just insert a picture of what I got from there. It was only a few things. It was like eggs and some mesquite flavor packets, and I think bacon and sausage was about all I got. But I will put a picture in right here so you can see what I got from Walmart. Okay, now let me go ahead and show you what all I got from Aldi's here. I did Aldi's pickup, and I'll put the price on the screen because they did have to refund me on one or two things they didn't have, so I'm not sure exactly. I haven't looked at my receipt to see the final price, but I will put it here on the screen for you. So anyway, let's get into this grocery haul, and I'll show you what I got. This is just some things that we are out of. You know, we need a little bit of produce and some creamers and snacks and stuff. Because I did do a big grocery restock um, here recently. You can watch that video. It's in my grocery hauls playlist. Um, so, you know, I just picked up some things that I used up this last two weeks. So I'm just kind of replenishing that. And, of course, getting there some snacks and produce. So, let's get into it. I picked up two boxes of this fuchsia chicken egg rolls. You get four egg rolls. These are just a good little light lunch for us or snack or whatever um, some days. So we like to get those. And I think they do come with some little like soy packets or something in them if I remember correctly. My husband likes the soy sauce, but I don't. I usually use something else. But I, I don't remember exactly what comes in them but you get four egg rolls in them so i picked up two boxes of those i picked us up this little box of bremer corn dogs you get six corn dogs in the box i picked up some of these deli rolls because i have some shaved steak in the freezer so i'll make us some sandwiches one day with this for either lunch or maybe a dinner I'm not sure so I picked those up I did pick up a Carlini canola oil I switched to canola oil instead of vegetable oil because um, a lady that I watch on YouTube all the time that's a really good southern cook she talked about how much better canola oil was better far as your health so I started using that instead of vegetable I did get this big thing of toilet paper. It's like 12 rolls of the Willow Essentials 1000. Uh, it says it's sep septic safe. So it's decent toilet paper. It's okay. I think my favorite toilet paper is like Scott. But a lot of times I'll get stuff, something like this. Because I don't think they sell Scott at Aldi's. If they do, it's probably a small pack. But anyway, I picked those up. I got some chips. I got the Clancy Wavy Potato Chips. I got Clancy's Restaurant Style Tortilla Chips. My husband eats most of this. Sometimes I'll have a little bit of chips with dip, but for most part, he eats all these snacks up. My snacks are mainly the little cookies and Cool Whip I'll be showing you. Uh, kettle chip mesquite barbecue now these are pretty good barbecue chips i have eaten a few of these before with like a cheddar dog or something you know had a little bit of chips on the side those are pretty good i love the flavor of those i picked up these bremer garlic chicken pasta packs these are really good it's got like carrots and broccoli and pasta and some chicken in them and the sauce you put in them is a uh, the sauce that's in them is really good. So I got two of those. And these are actually a 21 ounce bag each. And then I got some of these uh, Pablo Lindo. I guess that's how you say that. Uh, flour tortillas, medium soft tacos. I'm not good at uh, pronouncing stuff like that. I got some canned goods here just to kind of uh, restock, you know, what we just recently used. 
I got some of the Happy Harvest cream style corns. I got three of those. I got four of these Happy Harvest whole potatoes. I got two big cans of these Dakota's Pride Pinto beans. I picked up three of these beef stews by Brookdale. Got three of those. I got uh, one, two, three, four of these Happy Harvest cut green beans. I got four of these. What was it? Three. three no, okay, three. Three of these Happy Harvest Very Young Sweet Peas. Then I got one, two, three. I got three of these Happy Harvest French Style Green Beans. I got two of these Dakota's Pride Red Kidney Beans, the dark ones. Two of those. I'm just building them up slowly because I don't use those as much as I do some of the other canned goods. Um, picked up some garlic powder here this is by stone mill i was totally out of garlic and i always need to keep garlic tuscan garden deli slice mild banana rings tuscan garden golden pepperoncinis and these are like 16 ounce jars this is a 24 ounce jar it's the great gherkins kosher dill pickles then I got some feta cheese, which I didn't really need because I didn't look in the refrigerator first. So I got a little thing of uh, crumbled feta cheese. I got the Happy Farms by Aldi sharp cheddar. Finely shredded cheese. It's a bag, let's see, three cups, 12 ounces. I got two heads of lettuce. I picked up some of this Happy Farms Singles Cheese, just the American Orange Cheese. I got some baby carrots. I always get carrots because that's just a good side. Me and my husband both like carrots. I got two heads of cabbage. I picked up one of these um, English cucumbers. And then I got one pack of asparagus. I probably should have got two. But I didn't. I only got one. I got a thing of milk. I do my pickup through Google. That's why it always puts my name, Thriftastic Mom, on it. <laughs> um, I got some of this broccoli. I think I'm going to, like, fix these in the air fryer one day. I got a bag of onions. I got two of these Park View Classic Hot Dogs. I got two of those. That's what they look like. You get eight per pack. So I got two of those. I got a Park View Polska Kielbasa. I got three of these Tuscan Garden Ranch Packets. Three of those. I got Fit and active, light Cool Whip topping. This is my snack here. My husband don't eat this stuff. Um, I got this to go with the plain tater chips. The French onion dip by Friendly Farms. My husband don't like that. I got some more sour cream by Friendly Farms. Um, I don't know if I showed you these. The Clancy's Nacho Tortilla Chips. I got those. I got some Park View Cheddar Brats. I got some sliced ham. This is breakfast ham slices by Appleton Farms. So pick that up. Looks like you get about six slices in it. I picked up some uh, Fremont Fish Market Medium Raw Peeled Shrimp. I asked for the jumbo, but they didn't have it, so they replaced it with the medium size. Which is okay. They're, they're a decent size. I usually fry those up for my husband. Um, Countryside Creamery Sweet Cream Butter Salted. Got a pack of that. I got two of these because this is my little guilty pleasure. 
It's drinking this coconut coffee creamer in milk. If you've never tried it, it is so good. I like it better than coffee. I just poured me a cup of milk, put me a little bit of creamer in it, and some ice. It is so good, y'all. I love it. And these are my snack. These Fit and Active 100 Calorie Snack Packs. I take these, I get a pack of these out, and then I get me a little bit of the Light Whipped Cream. It's a great little snack. And just dip the little cookies into my whipped cream. So good. I love that. That's a, uh, a low-calorie snack. It's good. Uh, Boulder Classics Paper Towels. I got those. And that's pretty much all I got from Aldi's. And the little bit of stuff that I showed you from Walmart, of course. That's pretty much it. I haven't got any drinks yet because I don't know why when I ordered from Walmart, I did not even think about getting any drinks for my husband so you know how that goes and i was going to try to get some waters but they were out of the waters that i normally get so anyway he'll have to go pick us up some drinks sometime and you see there wasn't a whole lot of meat in here because we're probably going to run down and get some meats from the local meat market i actually stopped by one while ago that's closer to my house but they were a little pricey a lot pricier than the one i normally go to so, I'm probably going to run down there and get some meats and probably throw it on the end of this video. That way you can see what all I got. Okay, guys, here is the second part of my grocery haul. My husband went and picked up some meat from our favorite meat market. He come back with about $98 worth of meat here. So, I wanted to show you right quick what all we got so I can end out this grocery haul video. First of all, I want to say we still got some meat from our last haul. We still got the um, big pot roast and a couple packs of chicken. So we haven't eaten up all that meat, but we, we like to go ahead and y'all know we like to stock ahead. So anyway, he picked up some um, bulk sausage. This is in the hot. We like it the best. It has the best flavor. Um, he got three packs of that. These are running about... Three, let's see, that is $3.99, $4.18, and uh, $3.95, which is pretty good considering if you buy it at the grocery store. Sausage is pretty expensive, especially the kind I like from the grocery store. But this is better, better sausage for sure. Okay, he got us some chicken legs here. This pack has got two, four, six, eight chicken legs for $1.92. This one has got Two, four, six, two, four, six, eight chicken legs. This one was a dollar seventy-five. He said his chicken legs was on sale. Um, which you can tell that's a really good price for chicken legs. Um, he got one, two, three packs of chicken thighs. This one was three oh four. One, two, three, four. Might have one hiding under it. I'm not sure. Four to five pieces in each pack. Um, this one was two eighty four, and this one back here was two dollars and seventy nine cents. Then he got us two big packs of these pork chops. Looks like there's about five in a pack. Um, this one was six dollars and three cents, and that one was six dollars and eleven cents. We got a bunch of ground beef here. Um, they don't they don't put the price on all of them, but uh, there's a eleven ninety nine price and a twelve oh three price for all of the ground beefs we got. Then he got us four of these um, chuck steaks. These are really good steaks. Um, this one was four ninety five. This one was five fifty one. This one here was $5.97. It's a little bit bigger. And this one was $5.48. So that's pretty good for steak because it's really good steak. I went in um, I went in another meat market down the road just to check their prices out. And their steak was really expensive. So, And I didn't even see these kind in their meat market. So I'm glad that we can get these at a really good price. And then the last two packs here is just some fryer breasts. They're boneless, and um, it's like one, two, three, four, maybe five to six pieces per pack. This one was six seventy one, and the one at the back here was five ninety two. 
So that is all of our meats, guys. Anyway, guys, that's all the meat that I got to add to our grocery haul. Um, I hope you enjoyed seeing everything that we bought this week. Um, this meat will last us for several weeks. We don't eat all this meat up in two weeks. <laughs> but um, I hope you enjoyed the grocery haul. If you did, y'all give me a big thumbs up. Y'all leave me some comments down below. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you're not subscribed. And if you do subscribe, make sure you hit that notification bell. That way you can be notified when I upload new videos. And I guess I'll see you in my next video. God bless. Bye.